Hi, my name is Christopher Leonard, and I'm a business journalist based in the United States. And I'd like to tell you about my new book, Coke Land, the secret history of Coke industries and corporate power in the United States. In one way, this book is the story about one very large corporation in America called Coke Industries. Uh, it's a gigantic company that makes the kind of things everybody depends on for modern life, from microchips to clothing to building materials and fuel. And this corporation is owned uh, by some of the richest people in America, uh, two brothers named Charles and David Koch, uh, whose fortune combined is larger than that of Bill Gates. But this book is really more than the story of just one company. The reason I wanted to write about Coke Industries is that this company helps tell a story about economic life and political life in America today. Coke Industries is so large and so influential that an exploration of this company is in fact an exploration of the entire United States economy, from our middle class workers to our labor unions to financial traders on Wall Street, to powerful corporate lobbyists who literally help shape our public policy and write our laws. This entire story is told through the lens of the story of Coke Industries. I think that by reading this book, you can get a really accurate and deep picture of how the economic system in America works and how our political system in America works. It's a tour of our society and our economy. I'm profoundly grateful that readers in Russia would, would have an interest in this kind of book about American life and American politics today. And, and I've been particularly impressed with and, and really inspired by the brave investigative reporters in Russia who have been documenting big corporations, oligarchs, and the political system there as well. Uh, I think it's really inspiring the hard work that Russia's investigative reporters have been doing over the last 10 years. And I hope this book will, will live up to that uh, example of brave investigative reporting. I hope that in this book, you can find useful information uh, and history about what's going on in the United States and that could even help think about the system in Russia as well. So thank you so much for taking the time to think about this and happy reading.